Prince Kohio, an heir to the Hawaiian throne, was born on this day in 1871. To mark his special day, a parade was held in Waikiki, while others remember this ali'i by carrying on his legacy. KITV4's Paul Drews explains. Kuhio Day began with a solemn ceremony at the Royal Mausoleum, where Prince Jonah Kuhio Kalaniani Ole Piikoi is buried, and a number of people made a special trip to visit his tomb. We bring ho'okupu, which is a, a makana or a gift, um, with lei or a, a mele or a oli, and um, that's, um, that's the Hawaiian way um, in honoring um, our prince. Their gifts are given to the prince who was an heir to the throne after the Hawaiian kingdom was overthrown. After resisting the new government, he eventually went on to become a politician in it, fighting for legislation to help Hawaiians. He was the founder of the Hawaiian homelands, and uh, many of our uh, people have benefited from it. And this is our, a small way to honor him on, on his special day. <laughs> In Waikiki, his legacy lives on. He founded the first Hawaiian civic group and other organizations that were represented in the parade. While many took in the pageantry of the parade, for others, today was a day to reflect on the history of Hawaii and Prince Kohiro's role in it. I am a Hawaiian and I feel that we should uh, honor what we have and teach our children our culture, our language, our history, and, and Kohiro is part of that. You know, he's very um, instrumental in, the, in uh, the Hawaiian movement, the Hawaiian people. In Waikiki, Paul Drews, KITV4 News. Ceremonies to remember Hawaiian royalty are held on the birthdays of Ali'i at the Royal Mausoleum in Uwano and are open to the public.